Hi everyone, welcome to A Clary Tale and welcome to a brand new series of Santorini vlogs. I am so excited to bring you along on this wonderful trip we are going to have in Santorini. We have wanted to do this trip for a while now and I can't believe we're finally here. Look at it, isn't it glorious? We're just here outside the pool. Uh, you would have seen us getting here uh, just before this clip. Uh, we arrived here last night. It was around 7 p.m. that we landed. We flew via Tui and it was a really good trip. Um, the flight was about four hours in total. So when we landed, we had a private transfer waiting for us. It was the company that the hotel used. It was 25 euros and they took us straight to the door here and I filmed getting here and the room tour last night so I'll put those clips in here. Outside our room, we can have some nice relaxing times there. Yeah. And then this is our room. It's gorgeous in here. So there's a bed here, huge mirror, table. There's a wardrobe. We've got some extra pillows. A little kitchenette. We've got a kitchen sink. Kettle. Is that a toasty maker? A little toasty maker. <laughs> Does it come with anything? Oh, it comes with bowls and plates. Oh, extractor. Extractor and cups and things. Oh my wow. goodness me. Didn't expect this. No, I didn't. Lovely bathroom. bathroom. Is this a little? Oh, it's just a. Oh, it's this little sit down bath. Like a little half bath. Mm. Oh, the toilet and sink, another big mirror, and oh, we've got another bedroom. <gasps> right, so this is where. Oh, it's huge. It's a king size bed. Yes. Is it? Was it two? It's two bases. I think it's one bathroom. Yeah, it's it's one big bed. Oh, this is wonderful. And then we've got more storage here. I love how sort of rustic it is, the, the wooden little bed. wooden tables and yeah. wooden mirrors. It's great, isn't it? And the lights and everything. Lovely. And they put, that's a nice touch, they just put that up there oh, to stop yeah. the brightness of the light. After we checked into the hotel, we had a little walk around Thera, that is the town that we're in. And basically we're two hours ahead, so UK time, it was actually two hours earlier, so we were still quite awake, we were hungry, so we thought we would go for dinner in one of these beautiful uh, restaurants that look out over the sea. So I'll put those clips of our dinner in here. This is beautiful. We'll have to eat here one night. Beautiful. Babe, I love this. Look at the church. The fashion people, man. But can you imagine what this is going to look like in the daytime? Look, over, look at the view over there, it's absolutely gorgeous. This is where we're going to have our dinner. We're going to get saganaki and meatballs. And what are you getting? I'm going to get the tomato balls. Tomato balls. And I'm going to get the stuffed vine leaves. This one? Yeah. Simon's got himself a mythos. A beer. You had that in Greek in Athens in you. I've got a sprite. We've got some bread for the table. What did you say this was? Feta. It's feta with, um, with red peppers mixed in. Oh. You should see your view behind you. 
I gave that to you. <laughs> so, my sagamaki's arrived. We've got my meatballs. And then Simon's stuffed vine, was it? Stuffed vine leaves, yeah. Stuffed vine leaves and your... Tomato balls. Tomato balls. <gasps> oh, I got a smell of the... Is it basil? No, that, uh, could be, could be, no, it's probably parsley. Oh, I got a smell of that. That could be basil. Wow, this looks insane. These are so good. This saganaki is absolutely delicious, honestly. I think it's my new favorite food, <laughs> fried cheese. <laughs> We've got tzatziki here as well. Tzatziki, yeah. Tzatziki, to go with your tomato balls. And then these are amazing. Are they good? Yeah, they got rice and meat in the middle, and then like a lemon sauce and dill, and I love dill. Dill, rice, and a bit of meat in the middle, meat. and then the the, wow. the leaf. Oh, the meatballs got feta. Let's have a look inside. Wow, it's delicious. They they love their meatballs, don't they? Mm -hmm. Here, yeah. and they're so tasty. So, if anyone's interested, it's called Restaurant Remvi. So that was where we were sitting just then. Look at this. <laughs> now you're up to date. It is the next morning now and we are spending the day uh, in Thera itself. We're gonna check out the town. It's just a short walk from here. I can't wait to see it in the daylight because obviously we only saw it late last night. So can't wait to see all the beautiful buildings and the sea. So I'll take you along to show you what it looks like in the daytime. This is our, I was just sitting there. This is our hotel in the daytime. Look at this, isn't it gorgeous? So it's called Louisos Stylish Residences. And we are gonna head now to go and have a look at the sea and the cliff top. There's a lot of um, places like ours. So that was an apartment place. Uh, there's another one here. Whoa, this is just at the top of where we're staying. This restaurant looks lovely actually. It does, doesn't it? Oh, Look amazing. at this view! Yeah, but this was just pitch black last yeah, night. Yeah, so what we could see was the, obviously the villages on the other little islands on the yeah. other side. Yeah, there's a ship in. Um, so we can go, maybe go for an excursion there to, to Morocco. Is, is that the... That's the Calderon, the, right. that, that's the um, centre of the volcano that's still active. <gasps> So basically this whole island is a volcano and they have these little excursions so you can go to this in, in an excursion it's about 20 euros which is really good so we're thinking of doing it and yeah. um, you go straight there on on a boat and there's a hot springs as well Simon's picked up a coffee what was it called? Yeah, Fredo Cappuccino, Fredo cold cappuccino. cappuccino. He loves these. Yeah. I was gonna get the have an amazing cold chocolate drink as well what was that called? Is it just Fredo? It's just cold chocolate. Fredo yeah. everything. And but I just I just cleaned my teeth so I didn't. But I'm definitely gonna get a few while we're here because it's such a nice drink. It's they use a blender, don't they? Yeah. It's so yeah. good. So this is a museum and a church. We've got a spa hotel here. It's a really nice area. I love the sort of mosaic pebbles that they've got on the floor. Here we go, we're coming into the main area now. The Hotel Atlantis. You see that island of Hedibus? Yeah. This was all Santorini, one island. Right. And then the explosion happened. And it separated them. And basically these are the bits that are all left. And then that new bit in the middle has come out since <laughs> subsequent eruptions. Oh wow. But we are now on the edge of the crater of where the original volcano eruption was. Look, they've got the natural sponges that grow in the sea. So they must go out, out here and pick them all. Some uh, musicians. Look at that fish. <laughs> There's all these little streets, little pebbled streets. We're just walking down this one towards the old port. Look at these little streets. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, look at this. Beautiful. The amount of little restaurants and little villas here. Coming into the cliffside. Can you imagine this life? Yeah. Gosh, it'd be amazing. So 
you can take the stairs down or you can go in these all the way down. Look at this little villa. <laughs> this I can't stop looking at the view. That would be a nice place to watch the sun go down, wouldn't it? Nice, isn't it? Little steps. Oh, this is pretty. Ah, look. Tendering boats going out to the Oh, do you think it's? Oh, of course. I thought it might have been an, the, one of the excursion ones. Oh well. No, you're right. It's definitely going to the boat. Yeah, I think they're tender. Maybe that's more, that ship there might be yeah, a... Yeah, they look like a pirate. Well, there was a, uh, an excursion on something that looked like it. They called it the pirate ship, didn't they? Yeah. It's got sail. But look, that must be the little bit you go in yeah. to... Uh, there and there, on the other side. Of... Oh, yeah. To jump in the pool. Can't believe we're on a volcano. And it's active. Yeah, it's active. It's scary. Yeah. That bit's active <laughs> in the middle there. Yeah. That's... But then, now you really see where it just fell away. Yeah, into the sea. On the other part of this island, there's some gorgeous um, sands. There's a red sand and a black sand. I don't think we're going there, but no. sounds amazing. I think this is probably the store with the best view in the world. Yeah. <laughs> it's gorgeous pieces here. I think we're gonna go in here for a drink for that beautiful view. Are we going in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah? yeah? Here we go, I've got my Fredo chocolate. Cheers. Oh, I thought that's what you were doing. No, I was putting it in the chocolate. <laughs> What's that one again? It's a frappe. Frappe. So Sam's got a frappe, I've got a chocolate. And this is our view. So Santorini is famous for its blue domes and the blue dome buildings. They are mainly in Ia, so we're going to be going there tomorrow, so stay tuned to see those. So where we had our coffee was called the Volcan, and they have a cinema screen at night, which is cool. So we're going to walk back through to the little streets, the little shops, aren't we? So this is Ia over there. That's where we're heading to tomorrow. And I think this one here is the place we're staying. Yes, in a couple of days we are moving to a different hotel and it is on this side. There's actually a blue roof you can see on that side. This whole place is just glorious. I feel like it's like the whole island is like a five star resort or something. It's just beautiful. <laughs> Yeah. If you go around, there's a one with a blue dome in ah. the Blessed Virgin Mary Catholic Church, backside of this church. We're going to go and find this blue topped church. It is in theory, it's the most photographed church of Santorini. Slate building. Oh, yeah. So we've come back round now to where we ate last night, which was that Remby restaurant in that grey building there. Yeah. This restaurant looks great. It's called Mama Thera. Here we go, we've got a sign pointing to the blue roof. It must be up here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's gorgeous. So it's the same church. You just have to get around the back to take a picture of the dome. Yeah, to get the dome. We've got a Catholic cathedral of St. John the Baptist here. So we've just walked from our hotel down to here and that's the main sort of square where there's sh shops and restaurants. And this is where the bus station is. So it's for local buses, getting you to Ia and other places. It's quite small. Villagey. Very villagey. She told us to check 
the timetable the night before the day we want to use the bus because apparently they change daily. Uh, so we're going to have a little check for tomorrow's bus ride to Ia. So it's one euro sixty to Ia, and the times are all there. So we're going to take a picture. So it looks like you pay when you're on the bus and then these are the times we're just taking a quick picture 160 one way and then one on the way back as well picked up a hero and so it's pork pita and it's got chips tomatoes onions and tzatziki yeah So this restaurant is where we're eating tonight. It's called Rastoni and we're going to have this amazing view of the sun setting. So we just booked it now. We've put down a deposit and then we come back at half six and hopefully we're going to have an amazing view of the sun setting. We are walking back to our hotel now for a little relax. We might have a paddle in the pool and then we're going to head back out here again later on for the sunset and for a lovely meal. So that's the way up to our hotel. But we're just going to go to this little supermarket that's right here, just for some water and things like that. So because we have a little kitchenette, we're just getting some water and milk and uh, cereal and things because we don't have breakfast included uh, in our hotel. Can you see me okay? We're having a lovely relaxing time here by the pool. I adore Thera, I have fallen in love with it. I was literally walking through these beautiful places thinking, why have I never been here before? I recommend it. I've only been here a day and I can already tell you I highly recommend coming if you are thinking of coming to Santorini or it's always been on your bucket list like it has been on mine just do it get out here it is in 
incredible. I'm so excited to watch the famous sunset tonight over the town of Thera. The restaurants book up very quickly for the sunset, so I definitely recommend booking maybe earlier in the morning for later that night or even the night before they take bookings uh, because you do not want to miss this sunset. I can already tell it's going to be phenomenal. So we're heading back into town now for the sunset. Uh, it's about half six um, that our reservation is at and the sun goes down at seven. So we'll have a bit of time to watch it slowly move down. Rastoni. Oh, amazing right here so we've just got here and this was our reserved table so we're gonna have a beautiful view of the sun setting right what do we have we've got salads some appetizers pasta risotto greek traditional dishes moussaka Meat dishes, lamb, beef, got steak. Oh, they've got back the bar for dessert. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, lovely. So we've got our drinks. I got a seven up, and Simon's got this Santorini beer. It's Vulcan. Look at that label, Santorini Blonde. That looks awesome, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. Enjoy that. We've got another grilled cheese. Yeah. It wasn't Saganaki though, it was called something different. Yeah, I can't remember. I can't remember. I'll put the something. name of it up here. Yeah, I'll put the name of it there. Right, like, let's tuck in. Yes, it's tomato. Our meals are here. Simon's got the moussaka. So, what's in your moussaka? Lamb and potato. Lamb and potato. And and potato and aubergine and then I've gone for a Caesar salad looks delicious so it's got chicken prosciutto and parmesan cheese and oh it looks brilliant food with a view Is pretty much gone now behind the hill. Simon's picking up a traditional baklava. Look at that. We are back at our hotel now. We have had such a wonderful day. That sunset was glorious. It was just so beautiful. It was so relaxing and we just had the best time. I really hope you enjoyed this video of Thera. Tomorrow you will see Ia, so stay tuned for that. That is the town that's famous for all the blue domed buildings. So I hope you'll enjoy that in the next vlog. Thank you so much for watching today. Please like this video if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you next time. Bye!